What I heard when my ex-wife told me the ways in which she felt let down by me. Me removing online friends I no longer have a use for from my life. You're staying, you're staying, you're gone. Sorry. Wasn't sure about you, um, but I'm gonna to tip towards gone. So, gone. One of you two has been rejected. Who do you think it is? Wrong, it's you. You're in, you're rejected, sorry. And this was me making conversation on a first date. Was the sewing machine taken over by the spirit of Byron's grandmother? Could a plant really identify a murderer? Is it possible that a parrot could give a young girl the will to live? A fertilized octopus egg ingested into the human system actually grow inside the body? Welcome back to the show. Today we're going beast mode. Be a beast, that's the title of the video. New challenge for you guys. Oh, by the way, if you want to become a channel member, that's an exciting new thing you can do. Click join down there to become a channel member. You'll get access to exclusive videos that are for members only, including a recent one on my dating app, Hell. Dating apps, guys. What the... F I, I originally thought, who would ever want to go on a dating app and go on dates again? I was so happy single. And then I thought, yeah, well, I've changed my mind. You know what was right in the first place? Avoid, avoid... Don't go on a dating app if you want to retain your sanity. Find out more on the video. It's also available on Patreon. Now, what's going to happen actually going forward? Patreon, I'm going to do a podcast. It might be a video podcast or it might just be audio. I haven't decided yet. Patreon is the home of my podcast. Mr. Smully, you can just search it on Patreon. I'll come up or there's a link down there in the description of the video. And members of the channel get other exclusive comment content more in keeping with what you're used to seeing on my YouTube channel rather than the, the podcast format and you get this special uh, badge next to your name if you're in the live streams you're highlighted as a member it really is an exciting way to support the channel members of the YouTube channel and thank you I think I've got five so far let's make it 500 patreon also fantastic and you get the podcast coming up there on a weekly basis and if you're a member, if you do both that that would be so nice wouldn't it okay let's get stuck into it then so we're talking about going beast a new camp Campaign, guys, I want you guys to send me your pictures and I'll put them on my Instagram of you wearing a powerhouse beast fragrance in public. It has to, it can't be just in your front room. I have to have evidence of two things that you're out somewhere where it might be a little bit daring to wear Lapidus Pour Homme or Furio by Bogart. So, you know, uh, uh, at least in a pub or something or a party or a wedding, even, you know, a, a summer fate, some kind of social situation where you're going to smell and hopefully annoy people. And I need the bottle. I can't, you can't just have a picture smiling. You've got to have some balls, guys. You've got to, don't tell me the bottle's too big. You can put it in your pocket. We've all got pockets in our trousers and jackets and stuff. Put it in your pocket and I need to see you out somewhere in the real world with a beast mode fragrance. That is my new campaign. I've got three great beasts that you can buy that I would like to recommend as great examples you, you might want to try. So we're talking powerhouse beast mode fragrances, preferably I'm talking old school powerhouses. So it could be you know, Vintage Koros or something like that would be a, a great choice. Go and annoy people with Vintage Koros. Send me a video if you want, and I will put them on my Instagram. It's my new camp. A new fun. It's just trying something different. At least I try different things, even if I usually fail. Powerhouse. Got to be strong. and got to be maybe preferably old school, but we can negotiate that. Great example, first of all, Forio from Bogart, 1988 release, and... I find this on the UK uh, eBay for about £80, which is, is not as, as cheap as it used to be. This is an incredible powerhouse fragrance. It's animalic, it's musky. It has a little bit of exotic, almost an incense vibe. It's very, very rich and complex, but it does have this kind of barbershop 80s feel too. It is nuclear in terms of the projection and stuff. And I do, you know, people, the, the few number, the small number of women who actually speak to me uh, have said that they, they find this quite interesting and quite like it. Now, if you want to spend a little bit less, quite a lot less, Lapidus Porom 1987. Release and this is you can find this in the UK for like eighteen pounds. It's kind of coros but more so. It's it's got that barbershop vibe, that clean soapy vibe, but it's also got that pissy, funky, musky undertone and a bit of weird honey, funky, musky sweetness. It's really fascinating. I don't even know if I like it, but I just like the idea of wearing this in public. So if you are daring enough to wear this in a public place and post the uh, picture, but the best way for, to make sure I see it actually is if you can find me on Instagram. It'll be, let's do some Instagram thing. Uh, you can 
find me easily, Mr. Smelly1977, and DM me your picture. DM me your picture on Instagram, and I can share it. And if it's hopefully, if you've shared it on your own Instagram, I can repost it from then because I think the, the quality will be better. So post it on your Instagram, message me, tell me you've done that. I will share it, and it'll be called um, the Beast Mode Challenge 2024. Be a beast, be a beast, okay? So Lapidus Prime, another great example, and another great cheapie that I mentioned in the last video, just about qualifies, I think, as a Beast Mode fragrance. £12.20, I found, Giorgio for men. Beverly Hills Giorgio for men and this uh, incredible leather and patchouli combination similarities to vintage Givenchy gentlemen but at a fraction of the cost that you'll find a vintage bottle for and the modern version this still probably worth consideration but has lost some of its old magic so be a beast public beast fragrance pictures don't do anything illegal but post a picture of yourself I need the bottle I need to see that you're somewhere public other people in the picture if you can legally square that off would be fine you get what i'm saying let me know what you think about that in the comments down below and uh, i'll see you on my upcoming live stream we're br bringing the live streams back quick video today thanks for watching remember whatever you're doing in life let's project and although life can really sometimes stink especially if uh, don't go on a especially if you go on a dating app don't do that uh, but at least we can always smell good don't worry i'm fine everything's fine mr smelly is living the dream, winning at life. See you in the next video, guys. Bye.